This is every version of the Basilisk that LEGO has made so far. We have the 2002 LEGO Basilisk came from the Chamber of Secrets, set number 4730. The 2018 Basilisk came from Hogwarts Great Hall, set number 75954. The new 2021 Lego Basilisk came in Hogwarts Chamber of Secrets, set number 76389. There's lots of strong opinions for which one of these is the best made version of the Basilisk, but I'm here to share my thoughts and get your thoughts. So be sure to share yours in the comments below. So let's take a closer look at these. So this original one, it was awesome just because it was the first one. And for a long time, the only one for about 16 years, this was the only version of the Basilisk. And what made it great, not only the really nice printing on the side, uh, but my favorite part of the original Basilisk is these cool fangs. So the fangs are actually glow-in-the-dark daggers. So you can actually pull these out and use it to destroy a horcrux. So I have always loved this version. The 2018 brick-built version left a lot to be desired. In fact, a lot of people questioned if this was even the Basilisk. And to confirm that, I had to check LEGO's official description of the set that it was in. And they do call this the Basilisk. I know it's sad, guys. I know. It's not even the right color. And uh, it's, it's pretty terrible. Um, a lot of people thought that this was just like some kind of water snake uh, that, that I put in the set. But... I'm sorry to say this actually is a version of the Basilisk. Sorry, I keep knocking over the original one there. Um, but this sad little brick built version is a real Basilisk in Lego. And the newest version is pretty good. I mean, I do like the eyes on it. Those look great. Um, now the mouth, I think is, I don't know, a little lacking in a way um, because I, I just wish it had like bigger fangs, um, I think is my biggest problem with it. Um, I mean, it does look dark and menacing, but I'm looking for those big fangs in the front. That's what I'm missing here. Um, he said, I really love how the original, you could take the fangs out. And I guess technically you could take the fangs out on the 2018 one, but this one you can't. And it doesn't really have big fangs. It's, it's those are just its front teeth. Um, I do like the overall build of this one. If you're gonna do like more of a brick built version, this is pretty good. Although I do have a very odd, I, I don't know, what what is, what is this? Why is there a hole in this? I don't understand. So if you know the reason for that, or maybe they just put it there for no reason, let me know your thoughts in the comments because I am just confused as to why that's there. Uh, because if you take the original here, now the tail pieces look pretty much the same. Now, granted, there's like, what, 19 years between these two, roughly, something like that. Um, <laughs> the pieces are, are roughly the same, but obviously printed different. And you look, they seem to be, a, they are a different mold. They're just similar. Uh, but this old one does not have any kind of weird hole in it. <laughs> so not sure on that. Now they are, I think roughly the same length. I think the uh, the new one might be just a little longer, but actually if you put them like this, you can see the tail is the same. The brick built portion or the middle section compared here, pretty close to the same. And it's hard to compare the neck because they're they're shaped a little different. This one kind of leans forward a bit more. This one goes up more. Now it's pretty obvious uh, which one is uh, has a bigger head there, but that's because it also had the removable fangs, which is still very very 
cool. So size-wise, the first and last are pretty close. And this one almost looks like the baby version because <laughs> look how much longer those are. So now that you've seen every version of the Basilisk, tell me your thoughts. Do you like the original 2002, the little brick built water snakey one in 2018, or the new 2021 version? Let me know in the comments and I will see you guys next time.